Today I will be helping you all finally get CDK and Blocks Roots. So first let's go over what you must have. First you need 350 Mastery on Yama and Tushita, and you need level 2200. If you don't have the sword yet, don't worry. My 5 month old tutorial is waiting for you in the description and it's not outdated because the game hasn't updated yet! <laughs> but now let's get to the puzzle. Alright, to start the quest you want to come to this part of Turtle over here behind the mansion and start the quest with this NPC. And the door over here should be opened. Yep, right here. And trust me when I say go for the left scroll first. The Tushita scroll. Doc Legend. So to start Doc Legend, you need to talk to the Doc NPC at Turtle, Hydra, and Castle on the Sea. So let's go to those. So down here should be the NPC, which I'm sure you could talk to any. But you have to keep pressing next. Until it says, pardon me. <laughs> now I'm gonna teleport to my home, which is Castle on the Sea. You could just drive over there from here. And I'll be talking to the NPC down here. Never pardon me. And Hydra Allen is over there if you don't have portal access, but for the sake of the video, I'm going through the portals. And now over here should be the third one. There we go. Obtained Fragment. And now that we have that done, enter back in this building here and start the new quest here. Second trial, Sense of Duty. For this one, we have to wait for a pirate raid and complete it. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Shameless advertisement here, but join my Discord server if you want access to someone's private server. That's like honestly the best I could say. Alright, so I was in a VC call, so I decided to not record and just do it. Ah. Uh, I forgot about it just giving the fragment, so yeah, and I got a bomb which is over there. But let's move on to the next quest. Alright, and now Soulless. Alright, now I'm gonna just head to Sea of Trees since for Soulless you have to kill Big Mom in under 2 minutes. So I highly suggest having Buddha or some kind of high damaging fruit that you could solo with. You could also grab help from friends, which I recommend if you can't solo it. Alright, here we are. Now I just gotta start slashing away. What is that sound? Oh, I'm actually getting pretty low. And now I'll be transported to heaven. Once you get to heaven, which I probably should have stated, you have to light some torches and defeat enemies from each torch you light. So first of all, light torch and kill the enemies that spawn. You don't have to rush on this one since I don't think there's a time limit on this one. Just make sure you don't die. Damn, pretty close to dead. And there we go. Now just pass through this door. And there's a fragment. And now before we move on to the final half, I'd like to ask y'all to consider subscribing. And at the end of this tutorial, consider liking the video if you find it helpful. Now let's get back to the video. Alright, now that the Tushita scroll is finally done, interact with it, and burn it up. And now head over to the Yama scroll. Pain and Suffering. For this one, make sure you have Yama equipped in hand, and head over to an NPC, and get beat up. Just make sure you don't die though. You should get a scroll. Eventually. Alright, now I'm gonna get hit again. If you're having any problems getting it, put on delay so you regen faster. Dang, it just does not want to give it to me. Alright. 
There we go, finally. Debatably, the hardest one of the CDK trials is the Haze of Misery. It turns your screen foggy and you have to look all over every island for a group of marked NPCs. Like that. And just saying the Hydra NPCs could be marked too. And I mean the ghost ones that you found during the, I think it was the Yama Sword. Is it not all of them? You might just have to kill a specific amount of NPCs at a marked group. Alright, I made it to Haunted and some NPCs are marked and some aren't. Possessed mummies are. Demonic souls are. But the zombies weren't. But a tip that I highly suggest is having someone portal you to these islands since it's so foggy that you can't see. Where I'll just put a dirt sea map on the screen so y'all could have an easier time if you're doing it solo. There we go. Alright, now the final step for getting the CDK. The third trial of the Yama Scroll, Fear of the Reaper. For this one, you have to get a Hollow's Essence, summon the Reaper, and then die to him. And then it works like the third step where you get sent to a dimension you have to light torches. Now personally, I ain't trying to grind bones for it, so I had my account roll with its bones and it got Hollow Essence. So just TP to Haunted and have my account summon it for me. And then I just gotta accept defeat. There we go. Alright. Oh wait, I have to light another torch. I'm so dumb. And I'm still dumb, I have to light the torch. Oh my god. I did not expect that. Well, just have that noted that the boss uses dark. So try not to get stunned when you light it. And now go through the door. And you have all six frags. And now that you completed that, burn this scroll. And interact with this pedestal. In a gem wolf form and go into that hole. And prepare to fight a boss. But I think you could only damage with one of the CDK swords. And now, when you kill them... Do I... What's going on here? Ah. Alright. And now that's Cursed Dual Katana. I'm actually glad to have it on this account now. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and easy to follow. Have a good day and good luck grinding this mastery.